channel thank you all for being so so consistent in today's video i am in one of the most beautiful towns in halfway district it's called kavala and today i'm sitting here with the town chief and he's going to tell us more about this town talk about the beauty the livelihood of the people and also this town has the oldest episcopalian church in maryland county so hello how are you doing thank god and you i'm fine I'm happy to be here today. Um, can you tell us your name? My name is Alexander Isnehoski, General Tan Chief. General Tan Chief. <laughs> the last time I went to the Tan was a powerful Tan Chief. This is the General Tan <laughs> Okay, so can you please tell us um, some information about Grand Capada? Like, when was the town from there? The information you people need from me, I can get some information. What I'm doing. Yes, sir. That's what I want. Just tell us what you know. As I am speaking to you, 1734, when we from right I'm looking for this area to cut the area. When we say Kafara, the native is better. We went somewhere to look for it. But when we were coming, the country that I tell us is the door you carry. If the player going looking for when you find the player, the door, he will be weak. And when the door tired, he's not able to move. Then you need to play. Now the main, the little thing is with the, with the, door, what happened to you? Why you can't move? So, all the global people, they from BDB, 16 at the now. Love from here, there, then we land the area. Hapo. Hapo. We are defied from there, we went all the way with the Kune way. We went right down. Right down, when we were there, you have the problem, you can bring human beings and they can carry it to seven. So when it will happen now, one old man was there, they call it old man darling. He the one that only town here, town there. He the one that can speak the Ghanaian also ever. But he went to say that he maybe we have told him. Later when his men will come back now, then the people that are supposed to meet that man, not the people, that different people meet that man. different people bought the human being for him. Yes. Yes, my man. Um, now, um, that was decades ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That yeah. tradition was decades ago. Yeah, that's it. So um, now you're using cow and you're finding people. Are you still yeah. using cow and finding people? Yeah, we are still using cow and finding people. I mean, the town is right next to the ocean and it's very, very beautiful. Uh -huh. I mean, uh, we went to the ship and then I saw the town was like, no, I have to visit by all means possible. Like it's so, so beautiful. So how how are the people surviving this town? The town being for school. She pays her own clinic and then they pour their own uh, uh, how they call transformer. The government is not helping this identical town, I must admit. They are not helping. Now, it is because we and then the town live on the coconut and on the beach. Oh. Yeah. Live on the coconut and on the beach. I heard that. Sorry for cutting uh -huh. off. If you take coconut from the, the beach, the beach yeah. and now then you go with it, yeah. you get paid for yeah. That's the reason why I kill my own coconut and then I realized that, oh, I ain't drink a vala. Yeah. So, well, let's say the time she said I brought a coconut with yeah. me. <laughs> now, if you want to eat a coconut, mm -hmm. you go on the beach, you boss it. Meaning, you that, yeah, meaning that you are not going to sell it. Oh. Yeah. Now, we use the coconut, a contractor came to bore wires. So that is why the law, the town people implementing the law that you know what you pay coconut from the beach. So that we can make sure that all the horses in the Kavara are connected. Okay. So one thing that drew me towards this town was when I heard about the historical church here in Kavara. Yeah. So what can you tell us about it? Okay. This church, the Episcopal church that called Epiphany, it was built in the 17th century. 
and the missionaries came from Ebro, from the state. They came to Liberia and they landed here. The first thing they went to Hogere and they, they were the, the settle, but the people they threw away Christianity. They were now there, no missionary there. They will not keep the traditional practices. Yeah, so they think we. Uh, uh, this animal, how do you call it? No, not good. Uh, oh, good. Ho. And when they when they landed there, what they did, because they were not one of the people, they drove there and they killed their animal that they brought. Wow. Killed, yeah. How they left the place when they came. While they were leaving, they said, according to history, they said they. In their footprint, the people sent, they threw, they threw them sent away after they came to bring Kavada. How Kavada accepted them. After they accepted them, they started learning how to speak the Kubo dialect. And then the, the next thing they, they did was to translate the Kubo dialect to English. English. And they started writing the Kubo dialect. Yeah. So the people who founded the church were the ones who started transcribing this yeah. from Kubo to English. English yeah. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. So you can still use the church for service? Yeah, yeah because it is in our deplorable condition now. So they're using the, the school here, yeah, the school auditorium. Yeah. So right after they came with the, a, a dog, the dog used to help them to build. Wow. Yeah. The dog used to help them to build, and then giving the know that there were how many persons in Babin? Seven persons. Plus the dog. Yeah, plus the dog. <laughs> so, after he said the other person got sick, he died. The other person went at the roof while he they were building the place, he fell, he died. And at the end of the day, when all of them died, the door went up there too because it was in a room. I fell from there. I died too. Yeah. So the town people, they found it necessary that the people that came, we need to show an area where they will be buried. As I speak, we can go and see to where the door buried. They, they, we got the door for, and then there was some person that came to where they die after they die. The church was able to build up for, and the place is still fixed. So, okay. Um, thank you so much. Um, you said the name of the church again? Ipefele Church. Ipefele Church. 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 The oldest Ipefele Church. Yeah, the modern church in, in, in Liberia. The whole Liberia. Yeah. yeah, because it's a 17th century, it should be the whole Liberia. Yeah. Thank you all for being so consistent 
if you're new don't forget to hit the subscribe button and tap the notifications bell and keep watching out for more interesting videos from maryland county and other parts of liberia love you all so much